Hi guys, so today I'm going to be filming an upper body workout from everyone. I typically do workouts that are from an Instagrammer. Her name is Laura Julaine. That's where I got this workout from. Her workouts are so tough, but I love them. Um, the workout consists of three different circuits, um, and you're going to repeat each circuit four times. I will go through the exercises at the beginning of each circuit before we do them. Um, I will be alternating between 5 pound, 8 pound, or 12 pound weights. That's what I have at home. And I also have one 10 pound dumbbell that I might use. Um, but if you don't have weights, that's okay. Um, you can just use anything that you find in your house that can add a little bit of weight to your workout to challenge you. Um, I already warmed up before this. Um, if you guys want to take a second and pause the video and do a warm up, I always do this total body cardio warm-up video from fitnessblender.com. It's um, 10 minutes and you can find it under their warm-up and cool-down section or um, their cardio section, I believe. It's like total body cardio 10-minute fat-burning workout or something and that's what I use before all of my workouts to warm up. Um, so if you want to do that right now, go ahead and otherwise I'm going to start the um, showing you guys the moves for each round. So for the first round, we have dumbbell lateral raises. So that's going to look like this. And we're going to do those 12 times. And then we're going to take no rest and go straight into um, dumbbell Arnold press. So that is like this. Gets those shoulders burning. And then the last one for this circuit is dumbbell front raises. So similar to what we did first, just to the front. This circuit is going to burn our shoulders pretty badly, so be prepared. Um, so we're going to repeat that circuit four times and then um, rest 45 seconds between each round that we do it. And for this circuit, all of the reps um, are 12. So let's get started. First, we're going to have those side lateral raises. Oh, I forgot to start my watch, and I'm going to be annoyed if I don't start my watch. Sorry. Okay. 12 dumbbell side lateral raises. Next, we'll have those Arnold presses, and we're going to have 12 of those. Four more. I lied, it was five more. Okay, I'm gonna lower weight for the last one. We have those dumbbell front raises, 12 of those. If you need more rest time, feel free to pause the video and come back when you feel rested. But try to go through the circuits as quickly as you can, with as little rest as you can. Okay, 
Now we have a 45 second rest and then we'll start again. I'm probably gonna have to lower my weight as we go through each circuit, but that's okay if you need to do that too. I probably will not make this, make it through this with 12 pound dumbbells. That gets pretty heavy. Get some water if you need it. And let's start back up with those side lateral raises again. I'm gonna lower down to the eights for the last couple reps. And back to those Arnold press, 12 reps. back to the eights. Okay. And then take rest for one second and we'll go straight into those front raises again. before we repeat that two more times. We can do it. The part that gets me is the no rest. That's what gets the shoulders burning. Get some water if you need it. Let's get back into it. We got this. Arnold press. Oh, I need a lower weight on that. Oh, 
and then we just get those let those front raises and then we have to repeat it one more time we'll move on we'll be one third of the way done with this workout We finished three rounds. We're gonna repeat that one more time. Then we'll be done with this first circuit. My shoulders are burning. If you need to lower the weight in the middle of the reps, feel free to do that. Or if you feel like going faster than me, that's cool too. This is just me providing guidance on each movement. You don't need to go at the same rate as me. And let's get back into it for our last round of this first circuit. With those side raises, 12. Four more. Okay, Arnold press. Oh, this is burning. Way with those on press. Okay, when we just got those front raises, then we get a short break while I explain the next exercises. Okay, and that's it. That's our first round. Grab some water and then I'll explain the next exercises. Okay guys, hope you got some water. We're gonna move into the exercises for the next round. So this is gonna be the same format as the last round that we just did, but different exercises. So these ones are gonna target the chest, just like the last ones targeted our shoulders. So first, we're gonna have um, dumbbell chest press so, I mean, dumbbell bench press. So, for these, you're, we're going to do eight of them, but you're going to take four seconds to come back down. One, two, and then shoot back up and take it slowly back down. We're going to repeat that eight times. The second exercise in this round, you'll stay in the same position, but it's going to be dumbbell um, flies. So you're going to start with the dumbbells at the top or soup cans, whatever you're holding, and take your arms 
all the way down until you're almost touching the ground and bring them back together and down and back together we'll do that 10 times then the last thing for this round is gonna be um incline push-ups you're gonna have 12 of those so for this I'm gonna use a stair but you can use like a chair or whatever can hold you um whatever works for this um you could use like a table like coffee table or like your couch or chair like I said but I'm using the stairs and you're gonna just do a normal push-up but at an incline from the table chair stair whatever you're using you can't really tell that I'm on a stair but I am because we just gotta work with what we got you would typically do that on the bench but we don't have a bench because we're not in the gym so we're gonna get started with this. We're starting with that dumbbell bench press where you take four seconds to come back down and we have eight of those. So, let's go. Two more. Okay, just let me grab my other weights. We'll go right into those dumbbell flies. Ten of these. Okay. And we got those incline push ups. We got 12 of these. So our reps for this round are going to go 8, 10, 12. For those push-ups, if you don't have anywhere to do the push-ups on incline, feel free to just do normal push-ups. Also, if you have to drop to your knees, that's cool too. I probably will by the end as well. So let's go straight back into those bench presses with the slow um, movement. Eight of these. Got those down. Now the dumbbell flies. Ten of these. These burned last time, but we can do it.
those really burn my shoulders too and my chest I guess I never really thought of them as a shoulder so, shoulder exercise, but oh, my shoulders are burning from those. 12 push-ups. Six more. Okay. We're halfway done with this circuit. Halfway done with the workout, actually. So, we're getting closer. Back to those bench presses. I kind of lost count on that one, but I think it was eight. If I didn't do eight, make sure you do it. Dumbbell flies, 10 of these. Get ready for the muscles to be burning. push-ups then we're gonna move on to the last round of this circuit <sighs> I look so greasy in this lighting <laughs> four more We made it through our third round. One more, and then we'll have the last round of exercises. I believe it's triceps, if I remember correctly. Last time doing these bench presses, we got it. Okay. <sighs> now just those dumbbell flies and the push-ups. Let's do it. My arms feel shaky. Okay, now we just got those push-ups.
Okay. We made it through that round. One more circuit and then we're done with this workout. To get some water, take rest if you need it. And then we'll move on to the next circuit. For this last circuit, it's gonna be back to how we did it in the beginning where all the reps were 12 for each exercise. It's the same format as the rest of the workout that we've been following, but all the reps are 12 again. So it's slightly less complicated than the last one. So the first exercise that we have are dumbbell overhead extensions. So that looks like this. It really works those triceps. 12 of those. Then we have dumbbell hammer curls. These really work. These like burn my biceps really bad. So that's going to look like this. Kind of like a bicep curl. We have 12 of those. Then I'm going to have to move my iPad again. We're going to have tricep dips. Hmm, I don't know how I can make it so you can see. Okay. Tricep dips. I'm using this little trunk thing in my house. So, tricep dips. 12 of these. And that's the whole, whole, that's all the exercises for this round. I couldn't talk right there. Okay. So, same format as last time. Repeat everything four times, starting with those overhead extensions. I'm going to try it with the 20 pound. I don't know how it's going to go. If I have to lower the weight, I will. 12 of these. to the 12. Okay, now we have those hammer curls. Oh, these burn really bad, I'm not prepared. 12 of these. I'll go to the side so you can see. Okay, now we just got those tricep dips. You can use the same surface that you used for your um, incline push-ups. Okay, round one, done. Now we'll go back to those overhead extensions. If you need a rest, take a rest, get some water, then get right back into it. Like I said before, you don't have to go at the same pace as me. If you need to stop and lower the weight or increase your weight, just pick up where you left off. Okay, back to those hammer curls. Hammer curls have kind of been my favorite in quarantine. I've done them like every upper body workout. I'm trying to get better at them. I used to be only able to do them with fives. So I'm improving. more. 
Okay, back to those tricep dips. I forgot for a second. <laughs> There really is no good angle for when I'm trying to film those tricep dips. The camera's up close and personal with that one. Okay. Two more rounds of this circuit and then we are done. We will have made it through our upper body workout. Oh, I need to catch my breath. Okay. Now we have camera curls. I almost forgot. Okay. Okay, back to those tricep dips. And then we will be on our last round. So excited. Last round, my arms are feeling very tired, but it will feel worth it at the end. Just gotta keep that in mind. I've kind of been forgetting about the 45 second rest in between rounds. So if you guys wanna do that, feel free, but I just have been forgetting. Hammer curls for the last time. Let's do it. Last thing, and we're all done. Got those tricep dips. My wrists are sore. Okay, that is it. We have made it through our upper body workout. I am so sweaty. 
my arms are burning but it's worth it we finished so I hope you guys enjoyed the workout and next week I'll probably do either cardio or a leg workout I haven't decided but I hope you guys liked the workout for this week and next Friday I'll have another one for you bye Hi guys, so today I'm going to be filming an upper body workout for everyone. Um, 